Okay, we're gonna move to uh, Podi. Wendy Podi is from Indonesia, and he is going to share with us about the effectiveness of digital evangelism for the church in these troubled times. He is the Southeast Asia manager, a really cool and bubbly guy. Uh, he serves with Christian vision, and I will pass the time to Podi. Come and share with us. Hi, the vision. Hi. Hi, everyone. My name is Podi. So if you don't know my name is iPod, but just move the I to the back. Um, so it's amazing time that we are living right now. It's not easy. It's not easy for us, for everyone. Um, however, in the last two weeks, our ministry have heard a lot of good news. Number one, our team in Beijing already in lockdown since um, Chinese New Year, like end of January. So um, now they are starting back to the office one day a week um, to interact with other colleagues. However, you know, in that um, span of one and a half months, um, they seeing a lot of spike. You know, we heard the numbers in China, um, you know, 100,000 views, things like that. But the last one and a half months, it's just off the roof through millions. Um, so the message is we have a very small of window of opportunity here um, in respective countries. Second one, our ministry in Yesi is platform. We sharing number increased 43% globally. And in the pH itself, within the lockdown um, um, season from last Monday, we have an increase of sharing by one, um, 51%. In Indonesia, um, starting work from home start last week, we have an increase of share in Yesi is alone 50%. This is amazing number. This is showing a lot of people are eager to see, um, you know, to share content. Um, yes, we do need content. I agree with Nachi. Most churches are having online services. Even Justin Bieber actually attending um, church online with Judah Smith and live on Instagram while he is attending it. Um, in Singapore, I heard a, a church have a small group multiply to six online small group with new people. This is the time that people can be invited anytime. So the, 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 the question is how, next, next slide please. How do we effectively having gospel conversation at this season? Now in our ministry, we would like to share the technique and some tools that you can use. Um, next slide please. We always believe in pray, care, share. So we pray for the people and we pray, we ask God who you want us to connect. For my personal um, experience, I actually connected with some people through my university or my previous workplace. It's so easy, you know, people open up about their businesses, about their issue in the family, about the challenges this time. I cannot solve all the problems. I'll pray for them within my personal and pray for them together. I also show in care. I say, how are you? How are you going? How are your family? What's, what's up, you know? Um, maybe, you know, in Indonesia, a lot of movement, we buying like grab food and order it and showing care to other people, ordering for our family that, you know, my parents, we, they can order things online. So we showing cares. Um, also, we, it's important to share, not only to pray and care, but we want to share the good news of Jesus at the very season. There is hope. It's not about hope when the conflict will be real, gone, but hope for their life. Okay, next slide, please. So, um, this is a yes, it is. We this is a practically is a mobile app with a community inside it um, that will help each one of you to live life on mission, on the personal level. So, um, yes, it is will provide you with a community and resources such as video, blog articles, um, even a community behind it that will help you to share Jesus to connect with God, to connect with others, or connecting others to God. The feature like seven day challenge, you know, you can put your VIP list in that um, app and then the app will remind you every single day on to pray for your friend and to show care and to share something to your friend. You can write your testimony. Maybe you, you, I believe every one of you have a background um, how you met Jesus, but sometimes you don't write it. The app will help you to write your testimony. You, there is a gospel message. You don't know how to share gospel. You know, you, you don't know about the four pillars or whatsoever, but you can have a simple message about Jesus through this app. And you can have, um, you know, evangelistic video. It's a lot of library. It's not only videos for Christian, but this is a video that effective to be shared to non-believer, to start conversation. 
and you can search yes he is in the app store it's free for everyone you can just distribute it to your member to your ministry and you can search with us um, search us in social media as well in our instagram and also if you're having problem in sharing the gospel you can have a chat button and there will be yes he is represented that help you to go on through on living life on mission okay next slide please so in a nutshell um, yes, he is a personal evangelism assistant, and I would like to give you tools, um, utilize um, tips or to utilize these tools. Um, I reminded when I prepared this, I reminded um, about this first. Live wisely among those who are be not believers and make the most of every opportunity. Let your conversation be gracious and attractive so that you will have the right response for everyone. You know how to make it attractive. You can start with videos, a lot of videos about COVID, but you can share video of hope, video of love, video of faith. Um, be gracious. We're not pushing Jesus now, but we want to show care. A lot of people are vulnerable right now. God will speak into their spirit by himself. Um, so make the most, however, make the most of, ever, um, of opportunity. Next slide, please. Um, the slide before. So this is a trick. So when you, you contact your friend, ask them, prop them, ask open-ended questions. How are you? How how are you going? How's your self-isolation? What do you do in this time? You know, how's your business? How your how's your study? How, how about your national exam? Things like that. Then ask questions, you know, further questions. Do not just right away, straight away to like Jesus love you, they, he's died for you, and something like that. But let them process, let them process the circumstances. Help them like, what will you do if you're not in home right now? How's your work? You know, things like that. Present. If you have the opportunity, present. Present your gosp the gospel or the testimony. How are you going through all this life? I know you're having challenges also being in isolation, but I believe you have testimony what you learn throughout this season, throughout this week. And then if you can, you can pray with them. You know, you can pray um, verbally, you can connect with Zoom, or you can even um, type up your prayer for them. No one will reject your prayer at this very season. You know, you can instill gospel also in your prayer. Okay, so there are four P's. Probe, process, present, and pray. Um, apart from that, I would like to also share some resources for you. So all of you are on um, Facebook, are maybe managing blogs, managing social media for churches. You need content. And CV already produced videos throughout the last of 10 years, 12 years. And we put all the videos for free for every one of you to download it and use it. Whether, next slide, please. The video about testimony, dra um, um, you know, like um, dramatic story, informative, like infographics, creative concepts. So this is all free, available to you in different languages. So um, we are actually at the like, what, um, 30 um, countries and then 10 languages. So you can have, um, or if you, your language is not available, you can download it and just do voiceover. Basically, you go to resources.cvglobal.co, you search based on the topic of what you need and play to your friends, to, to your online services and to your social media. Next slide. This is some activity that you can do. Um, you can share yes, yes videos and you ask with a caption, what do you think about this video? Let's chat, maybe make some quiz. You can share a yes, yes video on the chat groups. You know, everyone is just sharing things. You can go, choose one video and share it to your chat group, where WhatsApp, Fiber, Messenger, or you can do seven day challenge weekly. You know, seven day to pray for, for one of your friend and the next one, the next one. Write your personal testimony in yes, yes app and share it. Share a yes is video to a family member or relative. Share a video or a friend in school. Share a yes is video to a friend in work or community groups. Share your personal testimony from yes is to Facebook or chat groups. So this is something that you can do um, to start to jumpstart your you know personal evangelism. Next one. Next slide. Okay. You know, guys, we believe that you know. Um, I, I, in the first two days, I was a bit like, hey, I, I work from home, all my team's working from home, like, okay, business as usual, but it's not. Business is not as usual now. It's very different. 
uh, we never know how long the window of opportunity will be will, we will have so let's start a pandemic of love that will bring hope to these people and will bring them to faith of Jesus if you want to know more um, you can connect me with me in Instagram at podi or um, you can connect me with within yes he is also thank you thank you so much podi this is awesome I, I I've been acquainted with CV and yes he is and they produce really excellent uh, video material and content and just so appreciate their heart. Mm -hmm. uh, reminder for us to pray. God will increase our burden to care for those and in caring, we are sharing also with those that really need to hear.